Is public safety at risk in Wilkesbury because of community fire watch patrols? The union representing the firefighters says yes. The mayor says no way. Eyewitness News first told you about this controversy earlier this month, and I team reporter Andy Mahalshik is outside fire headquarters with the latest developments on this story. Andy? Well, Candace, the Firefighters Union is turning up the heat on the city administration to end these fire watch patrols. They say these patrols are causing fire engines to break down, thereby jeopardizing public safety. But Mayor Tony George insists that, that is pure nonsense. He doesn't buy that argument, and he says these fire watch patrols will continue. The increased wear and tear on these vehicles is, is starting to add up now. And that's why this is happening all too often. This video was taken on September 6th when this fire engine broke down on Union Street. Uh, we have three apparatus now, life-saving pieces of equipment that are out of service for repairs. Uh, some of them will be extended repairs. The Firefighters Union is once again sounding the alarm and even posted a warning to the public on its Facebook page. It says a ladder truck and two fire engines are in the repair shop. Mayor Tony George started 24-7 fire patrols in the city earlier this year. Firefighters, in addition to answering calls, go out looking for potential fire hazards, such as dilapidated buildings, anything that could possibly start a fire. We caught up with a patrol today, but firefighters say this is a recipe for disaster. We need to go back to the way these fire watches are supposed to be performed. Um, having the apparatus go out and check specific areas when there are specific problems, not just wandering around, increasing the miles, increasing the wear and tear on these vehicles. See, I don't believe fire trucks are made just to sit in a fire headquarters. But Mayor Tony George is firing back. They have diesel engines. They're, they're made to fight fires. If you go to New York City, they're going constantly 24 hours a day. And he insists the breakdowns are not connected to fire watch patrols. It's not a problem. The, the, the ladder truck has been off and on for probably about eight or nine years. We're in the process of seeing if we could afford a new one. The other one engine is under warranty and it's being repaired. And the other engine's on for, for an inspection, which is routine maintenance. Bob Kadlabowski runs a towing company in Wilkesbury. He is known as a watchdog of taxpayer money. He doesn't like it. These trucks are made to go to point A to point B and not to cruise around it. They're not designed for that. It's a complete waste of money. And once again, Mayor Tony George insists this is all about public safety, keeping the residents of the city safe, being proactive to stop fires, and that these patrols are here to stay. The firefighters say they agree with the mayor, but they believe he's going about it the wrong way. Reporting outside Wilkesbury Fire Headquarters, Andy Mahal, Chicago Witness News. Thank you, Andy. And we must point out that all of this is happening as contract negotiations are underway between the city administration and the firefighters union. Both sides insist this controversy has nothing to do with those contract talks.